Hey guys, uh, today we have a box of EXO2 Digital Hazard from Digimon. Uh, it is a, it is the second EX set, and this one is based on Digimon Tamers, which is my favorite Digimon series. So all of these guys are going to be like Gilmon and Renamon, Terriermon, and Impmon, and the D-Reaper cards. I have already opened one box of this uh, at home, and I do enjoy the cards from this set, and it is a small set like EX01 was, that classic collection, but so we are also getting a box topper that is a alternate art from the two starter decks uh, with the multicolors, so we get either Mastamon or Imperial Dramon. And then this one we got Mastamon, which is a pretty cool card. So, we got 24 packs. Let's crack into them and see what we get. Right, pack number one. Alright, so to the start we got... Devadramon and Lotmon. Pretty cool card. Growlmon. Plugin A. Offensive plugin A. Uh, Renamon decks for this set will have a really good setup for using plugins of any color. We've got Labramon. Alright, search your first D Reaper card. So as you can see, it doesn't have a level. And that's because the D Reaper cards have a special uh, way of building their deck. Uh, Palaited Gorillamon, Monodramon, Death Stinger option card, and our Reaper, which is the uh, guy that you are aiming to get out onto the field with the D Reaper cards. And we got Megadramon, which is our first super rare. A red purple, which is a really cool card. Alright, moving on. I am looking to pull a uh, Gallant Mon Crimson Mode and one other card to complete the set itself, though that's not all the alternate arts. So we've got Grand Locomon, another D Reaper card, Labramon, another Palette Head, Fist of the Beast King, Gatekeeper, big key card for the D Reaper deck, Jaomon, I think that's our first baby, Fireball, oh we got Kalamon, Kalamon's a favorite among a lot of people who like tamers. And Marine Angemon. Pokemon, Fist of the Beast King, there is another D Reaper card, Bubbles, another Gatekeeper, which will be great, because I'm planning on building a D Reaper deck, another plug-in, Ice Devamon, which was given a strange, like, Christopher Walken type accent in the English dub of Tamers, kind of a weird choice, Hopmon, another baby. Or Growlmon. Oh, there's Gilmon. I've always liked Gilmon. Oh, there we go. Wow, we are, what, four packs in and we got one of the guys I wanted. Uh, this is a secret rare Gallant Mon Crimson mode. There is an alternate art of him that I would like to have, but this and one other card will complete the numerical set for me.
The other secret rare in the set is uh, Bialzaman Burst Mode, which I pulled out of the other box that I have opened. Gargomon, another fan favorite. Andromon, I've always liked Andromon. Cubimon, I believe Professor Broke would like that simply because she loves Nine Tails. Another Ice Devimon. There is another D Reaper card. Uh, another plug in. Another D Reaper. Another plug in. Reaper Mon. And Alice McCoy. It's a good tamer for purple. Henry. That's one of the tamers. And he's in the pack with his guy, Mega Gargomon. So we got basic Locomon, we have another Devadramon, Lopmon, Growlmon, another Pilates Head, Bubbles, Ice Devimon, Caesarmon, which has always been a really cool card. And it's nice to have another jamming card. Rapidmon. Another uh Terrier Mon Evolution, pretty good card. Jerry, which is a interesting card, and she's of course got a Leo Mon effect. Oh, we got Imp Mon, another fan favorite. And Antila Mon. Strikedramon, Mephistomon, Ground Locomon, Hornstriker, Labramon, Gorillamon, Gatekeeper, oh, Pendulum Feet, that's one of the D Reapers we haven't seen so far, Pixiemon, which is Rinamon's baby, uh, Jerry is a key card for the D Reaper set, Nerd D Reaper cards, Rio. It was just kind of thrown in at the end of Tamers for no reason than to have a character that other people knew from video games. We have another Reaper. A Gargomon, an Andromon, a Cubimon. Adjusting the light here. There we go. Uh, another plug in, another searcher. Those are key to the D Reaper deck because you can have as many of them as you want and they build up the rest of your deck. Fist of the Beast King, plug in. D Reaper, Su Chong Wong, it's Henry's little sister. We got a Monodramon, we got another Guillemon. And our rare from this pack is the blue card, which allows us a chance at a quick dig digivolution. Be interested to see how many alternate arts we get, seeing as we pulled the secret rare pretty fast. So we got Mephistomon, we got Ground Locomon, Cargomon, Labramon, Gorillamon, another Gatekeeper. Looks like we got something interesting at the back of this pack. One damn feet, another plug in, another Jerry. Uh, D Reaper Jerry. We got another Antilamon and ooh, looks like we got an alternate art of Viximon. That's neat. It's got a texture to it, which most other cards don't really have as much in Digimon. But that's neat. That's the first 
alternate art baby I've seen, aside from like a reprint from a different set. Pokemon, Devadramon, Lapmon, Creepans, we got another plugin, we got a Labramon, we got another Searcher, we got another Pilates Head, and a Gummymon, that's another baby, that's the baby for Terriermon, Death Stinger, we got Cyberdramon, really cool guy, and we got Sakuyamon, or Sakuyamon. Really nice card. Great art. And Randomon's final evolution. A lot of people are looking to play the uh, Sakuyamon deck simply because you can play a lot of option cards for free that are plugins with of any color. So we've got Growmon, Strikedramon. Mephestomon, Gorillamon, Fist of the Beast King, we got another Bubbles, we got a Gatekeeper, another Plugin, another Baby, so we got another Hotmon, Wargrowmon, we got Dobermon, I've always been fond of Dobermon, and we got Mika. Interesting pack. Rika's obviously a key card for the Renamon deck. I have been waiting for this set to come out simply because Tamers being my favorite Digimon series, it will have all the guys that I like. Ground Locomon, Gargomon, Andromon, Ice Devimon, Pendulum Feet. Optimizer, Caesarmon, another plug-in, Yamon, there's the baby Entmon, Kenta, there is the Mother D Reaper, which is the core of the Reaper deck, and interestingly enough, it is a Digitama, it is a baby, uh, but it has no level and it has 15,000 power. So. Uh, it doesn't act like other eggs, um, but it can be put onto the other field. Can be put onto the field, unlike level two Digimon. It just can't attack. But that is the core between that and Searchers is the core of the D Reaper deck, which is good because I think that means that makes I have four copies now, and I need those for the deck. We also have Terriermon as our rare. Terriermon is super popular. And he's a really cute Digimon. Andromon, Cubimon, Locomon, Searcher. Fist of the Beast King, another plug-in, Optimizer, Creepans, another Gummy Mon, some Su Chong, another Ryo, and ooh, so this is the alternate arts they have been putting in the set will show the Megas with their tamers. So Antilamon is with her tamer in this picture. So we saw the other Antilamon earlier, and that is the alternate art of it. Cubimon, Pokemon, David Dramon, Creepans, Horn Striker. Offensive plugin, Searcher, Gorillamon, Gigimon, which is uh, Gilmon's baby. 
We got a Parasite Mon. I and Mako, it's Impmon's Tamer. And we have Renamon, which is probably one of the most popular rookies now. Alright, I think we're about halfway through this box now. Kinda wondering what kind of other alternate arts we might pull. Botmon, Growmon, Strike Drummond, Bubbles, Plugin, Pendulum Feet, Caesarmon, Creepans, uh, Kazu, Taomon, Gardramon, and another Mega Drummond. So this is the regular art and the one we pulled earlier is the alternate art. Mephistomon, Ground Locomon, Gargomon. So this is a fairly small set, so we see we will see a lot of repeats among the commons and stuff. But that's not necessarily a bad thing if you're building a deck. Fireball, I think that's the first one of those we've seen so far. Reapermon, Takato, who's Gilmon's Tamer. And another Kalumon. Cubimon, Locomon, Devitramon, Optimizer, Plugin, Horn Striker, Offensive Plugin, Xiaomon, that's another baby for us. We got Ellis McCoy, and we got another Marine Andrewmon, as well as Henry. Strike Dramon, Bohani's Head, Bubbles, Ice Devimon, Caesarmon, Horn Striker, Rafiximon, another baby, Rapidmon, Impmon, and Bialzamon. Definitely one of the most popular Digimon around. The cool biker dude with a gun for an arm. Super anti hero guy. We got Growlmon, we got Strikestermon, we got Mephistomon, we got another Caesarmon, definitely have a place out of those now. Horn Striker, Habramon, Gorillamon, Gatekeeper, Jerry, another Jerry, another Reaper, and Leo Mon. Leo Mon's always been kind of cool, in my opinion. Pokemon, Carcomon, Andromon, Pendulum Feet, Plug-In, Searcher, Fist of the Beast King, Plug-In, Suchamon, Monodromon, another Kielmon, and another blue card. For anybody who isn't aware, uh, in Digimon Tamers, uh, the characters actually use, so we got Cubimon, Locomon, Devidramon, uh, they use cards that they can put into their Digivices from the actual card game at the time of Digimon 
to power up their partners in battle because in that world Digimon existed as its own thing before Digimon started to become real. Snobbermon, Searcher, Gummymon, Dislinger, and Cybertramon, and Dobermon. Uh, thus, the blue card uh, became a constant thing where the tamers tended to use a blue card that would appear to help with Digivolution. Lotmon, Growmon, and for anybody who hasn't seen it, I'm not going to spoil anything else about that. Strikedramon, Pilates Head, Gorillamon, Fist of the Beast King, Bubbles, Gatekeeper, Hotmon, or Growmon, another Rika, and another Mother D Reaper. Alright, we got three packs left. So, we got Mephistomon, Brown Locomon, Gargamon, Digivolution Plugin, Ice Devimon, Pendulum Feet, Optimizer, Caesarmon, Yaman, Kinta, Terriermon, and Gallantmon. Gallantmon is probably my favorite Mega, but mostly because I liked Gilmon as my favorite rookie in the series. Pokemon, Plugin, Creep Hands, Horn Striker, Plugin, Searcher, Gigimon, Parasite Mon, Ion Mako, and Renamon. Alright, last pack. Let's see if we get any alternate arts or anything out of this one. But so far, I've enjoyed every pack because I love this Digimon series. Divigermon, Popmon, Growmon, Gorillamon, Bubbles, Plugin, Pendulum Feet, Caesarmon, Kazu, Taomon, Gardromon, and Takato. So, no alternate arts in that pack, but still a great set. Uh, so, let's take a look at what we pulled as far as rarities and such go. So we definitely got more than a few babies this time, which is really good. Um, sometimes it's hard to pull babies. We got some Woody Reapers, but most importantly, we got an alternate art of Fixiemon, which is rather adorable. So let's see what our big pulls were. We got a few Tamers, so we got Takato, we got Renamon, uh, so Gallantmon, Dobermon, a couple blue cards, Leomon, Beelzemon, Henry, we got a couple Marine Angemons, we got Calamon, we got Regular and Alternate Megadramon, Redamons, we got an Alternate Art Antilamon, so so far we've had three alts. Terriermon, another Erika, Sukuyamon, I'm not sure if this is the alternate art or not, I did pull the other artwork from the other box that I have opened, but I'm not, I'd have to look at the set to see which one's the alternate art, but it's still a beautiful card either way. So we got a blue card, we got a couple Reapers, super important for a Reaper deck, Mega Gargomon, and this guy is our secret rare that we pulled, Gallantmon Crimson Mode. That means I have both secret rares because I pulled the Alzamon Burst Mode from the other set, or the other box, 
but I do need to look at my collection to see what the other card was, because I only needed two. There's our other Marine Angemon, and another Randomon. Overall, pretty good pulls. Uh, solid box. If you like Tamers, I would recommend this set. And if you want a interesting playstyle, D Reaper is going to be a very, very interesting deck. Uh, anyway, so if you like this, if you want any more details about it, uh, please feel free to like and comment and let us know what you like. Uh, thank you and have a good day.